All right, I'm gonna have a little bit of fun with this. Let's play ball with uh, this commenter over here, and I would really like to them to see the smirk on my face in the middle finger for this one. Yeah, yeah, fuck you, buddy. Yeah, I'm in this video. Yes, Kamala Harris's running mate is a joke and an arrogant prick, and I'm sticking by it. But this uh, person here with no content, you know, gives a no comment. You can tell by his face here, a baby-faced little shit. Still living in a room in his parents' house. Uh, or whatever the hell. Oh, maybe you can afford your schizo meds with his help. Oh, really? I don't, just because I don't like her running mate or even her. I should take, oh, anybody who has an opinion that you don't like. Or who doesn't like somebody you like should take schizo meds. That's actually saying that you're some kind of little communist punk who... Uh, thinks mind-altering drugs is the answer for have somebody having an opinion that you don't like other than yours. And if any, and if you believe somebody should take such meds, a coward hiding behind a little communist punk and a cowardly cowardly punk <laughs> hiding behind a uh, smartphone and a computer. Um, Dream on. Is, are you really think someday there's going to be an enforcing class that's going to make me take such meds or maybe punish me for my opinions or whatever, too? Really? Um, and in another question, too, who is going to make me take such meds? You? Or is there going to be some elected official that's going to create some enforcing class that's going to make me take such meds? Really? Uh, Oh, maybe that's your little delusional fantasy while you're in a living in a room in your parents' house. And the only thing I would say about that is uh, maybe you should get a uh, lease of your own and an income of your own while you still know everything. Uh, um, you uh, arrogant little communist punk. Uh, go fuck a goddamn porcupine. How's that?